Martha's first destination was the village marketplace. As she strolled through the bustling stalls, she peered through the kaleidoscope and saw a merchant whose heart emitted a dull, gray color. Ella approached the merchant and, with gentle words, discovered that he carried the weight of financial worries. Determined to bring back the colors, Ella shared stories of hope and resilience with the merchant. Slowly, the gray hue began to transform into a soft shade of blue. The merchant, grateful for Ella's kindness, felt a renewed sense of optimism, and the blue color radiated from his heart, harmonizing with the village's energy. Emboldened by her success, Ella continued her journey, visiting homes and public spaces where the colors had faded. She discovered a child in the park whose heart held a muted green, reflecting feelings of loneliness. Ella, with a heart full of compassion, spent time playing with the child, nurturing a sense of friendship that transformed the green into a vibrant shade of emerald. In the heart of the village, Ella encountered an elderly woman whose heart glowed with a dim purple. The woman, burdened by the weight of memories and solitude, found solace in Ella's company. They shared stories, laughter, and moments of connection that gradually turned the purple into a radiant violet, symbolizing the warmth of companionship. As Ella traveled through the village, using her kaleidoscope to reveal and restore the colors in people's hearts, the atmosphere began to change. The once muted tones of the village blossomed into a kaleidoscope of hues, reflecting the diverse emotions and experiences of its inhabitants. Word of Ella's magical journey spread throughout the village, and the Rainbow Guardian observed with joy as the vibrant colors returned. However, there was one last challenge that awaited Ella, the mystical rainbow flower at the heart of the hidden meadow. Meadow. Legend spoke of the rainbow flower as the source of all colors in the world. It was said to bloom with the combined energy of the emotions, hopes, and dreams of the villagers. Ella, guided by the Rainbow Guardian, made her way back to the meadow, eager to complete her quest. As she approached the magnificent tree, the Rainbow Guardian materialized once again. Ella, you have done wonders in restoring the colors of the village. Now, it is time to awaken the rainbow flower and bring back the full spectrum of emotions to our world. With the rainbow guardian's guidance, Ella approached the rainbow flower. The petals of the flower shimmered in various colors, but there was a noticeable gap, a void that needed to be filled. Ella, understanding the task at hand, closed her eyes and allowed her heart to overflow with gratitude, joy, and love. As Ella opened her eyes, a burst of radiant light emerged from her heart and merged with the rainbow flower. The void was filled with a new color, a brilliant blend of gold and silver, symbolizing the harmony of emotions and the magic of interconnected hearts. The rainbow flower, now complete, emanated a dazzling glow that enveloped the entire meadow. The colors cascaded from the flower, creating a mesmerizing display that painted the village with a renewed sense of vitality. The Rainbow Guardian, pleased with Ella's efforts, spoke, Dear child, you have restored the balance of colors and brought harmony to our world. Your heart, filled with kindness and compassion, has woven a tapestry of emotions that will endure for generations. As a final gift, the Rainbow Guardian transformed Ella's kaleidoscope into a radiant pendant, the Heart Prism. The Heart Prism, infused with the magic of the Rainbow Flower, would forever remind Ella of the transformative journey she undertook to bring bring back the colors of the world. Ella, adorned with the heart prism, returned to the village as a beloved figure. The once muted tones had been replaced with a vibrant spectrum, and the inhabitants celebrated the magic that Ella had unlocked within their hearts. And so, in the quaint village surrounded by emerald green hills, the legend of Ella, the rainbow guardian, became a timeless tale. The heart prism, a symbol of love, compassion, and the interconnectedness of emotions, adorned Ella's neck as a reminder that even in the most muted hearts, the potential for a kaleidoscope of colors awaits, ready to be revealed through the magic of understanding, empathy, and the joyous dance of emotions. Title, The Whimsical Wonders of Windy Hollow In a charming town named Windy Hollow, surrounded by rolling hills and fields of wildflowers, there lived a young girl named Lily. Windy Hollow was known for its whimsical nature, where the wind seemed to carry laughter and the air was filled with the sweet scent of blooming flowers. Lily, with her golden curls and a heart full of curiosity, loved exploring the nooks and crannies of her lively town. One day, as she wandered near the outskirts, she discovered a hidden path that led to a mysterious forest. The entrance was adorned with sparkling fireflies, inviting her to step into the enchanting world beyond. 
As Lily ventured deeper into the forest, the trees whispered secrets, and the sunlight filtered through the leaves, creating a magical dance of light and shadows. She felt a sense of wonder as the path led her to a clearing where a peculiar tree stood, the Whispering Willow. The Whispering Willow, with its silver bark and leaves that shimmered like stardust, had a unique ability. It could speak to those with pure hearts, sharing ancient tales and offering guidance to those who sought it. Lily, with her heart full of kindness, felt an immediate connection with the wise tree. Welcome, dear child, the whispering willow spoke in a gentle breeze, I sense a curious spirit within you. Would you like to hear the tales of Windy Hollow and the whimsical wonders that surround us? Eager to unravel the mysteries of her beloved town, Lily nodded, and the whispering willow began to weave tales of magical creatures, hidden realms, and the harmonious balance between nature and the townspeople. Lily listened with wide-eyed fascination, captivated by the enchanting stories that unfolded like petals in a mystical garden. One tale that intrigued Lily was about the elusive harmony butterflies. Legend spoke of these radiant butterflies that embodied the essence of joy and unity. The butterflies, said to be guardians of Windy Hollow's whimsical nature, fluttered through the town, spreading happiness and ensuring that the harmony between nature and the townspeople remained intact. As the whispering willow concluded its tales, Lily felt a sense of responsibility to uncover the mysteries of the harmony butterflies. She bid farewell to the wise tree and embarked on a quest to witness the whimsical wonders of Windy Hollow. Her journey led her to various corners of the town, from the lively market square to the peaceful meadows. Along the way, Lily encountered a colorful cast of characters, a mischievous squirrel named Skip, a melodious songbird named Melody, and a wise old owl named Oliver. Each of them shared snippets of their own encounters with the Harmony Butterflies, adding layers to the magical tapestry of Windy Hollow. As Lily, Lily delved deeper into her quest, she discovered that the Harmony Butterflies were drawn to acts of kindness, laughter, and moments of genuine joy. They reveled in the playful dances of children, the shared laughter of friends, and the soothing melodies of the townspeople. The more love and harmony they witnessed, the brighter their wings would glow. One day, as Lily explored the edge of Windy Hollow near the babbling brook, she spotted a gentle flutter of wings. A group of harmony butterflies, their wings shimmering with a kaleidoscope of colors, hovered above a group of children playing by the water. The children, unaware of the magical guests, giggled and chased each other, their laughter echoing through the forest. Lily, overcome with joy, approached the harmony butterflies with gratitude in her heart. As she expressed her appreciation for their presence and the magic they brought to Windy Hollow, the butterflies circled around her, leaving a trail of sparkling dust that settled on her shoulders. The Harmony Butterflies, enchanted by Lily's pure spirit, revealed their true magic. With a gentle touch, they bestowed upon her a small, iridescent locket containing a tiny butterfly-shaped charm. The locket, they explained, held the essence of Windy Hollow's whimsy and served as a token of gratitude for Lily's role in preserving the town's enchanting nature. From that day forward, Lily became Windy Hollow's honorary guardian of whimsy. The townspeople, inspired by her quest and the magical encounters with the Harmony Butterflies, embraced the spirit of joy, kindness, and unity. The mischievous squirrel Skip organized playful gatherings, the melodious songbird Melody organized community singalongs, and the wise Owl Oliver offered his guidance to those seeking wisdom. Windy Hollow transformed into a haven of whimsical wonders, where the wind carried not only laughter but also the vibrant energy of harmony and joy. The once hidden magic of the town became a shared experience, and the townspeople reveled in the enchantment that surrounded them. One evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon and the stars began to twinkle, Lily returned to the Whispering Willow to share the tales of her quest and the magical encounters with the Harmony Butterflies. The Whispering Willow, proud of the young guardian, swayed its branches in a silent applause. You have uncovered the secrets of Windy Hollow's whimsical nature, dear Lily, the Whispering Willow whispered. May the town continue to thrive in the magic of joy and harmony, and may your heart forever be connected to the whimsical wonders that surround us. Lily, wearing her iridescent locket, felt a deep sense of fulfillment. The tales of Windy Hollow's enchantment would be passed down through generations, ensuring that the whimsical wonders endured as a cherished legacy. And so, in the charming town named Windy Hollow, the whimsical wonders continued to unfold. The harmony butterflies danced through the air, the mischievous squirrel skip led playful gatherings, 
the melodious songbird melody orchestrated joyful singalongs, and the wise Al Oliver shared his timeless wisdom. Lily, the guardian of whimsy, became a beacon of inspiration, a reminder that in the heart of every town, there lies a magical tapestry waiting to be woven with acts of kindness, laughter, and the joyous dance of harmony. Title Title, The Lost Lighthouse In a small coastal town nestled between rugged cliffs and the rolling waves of the sea, there lived a curious young boy named Jamie. The town, named Seaview Haven, was known for its picturesque scenery and a mysterious lighthouse that stood tall at the edge of the cliffs. The lighthouse, with its white and red stripes, had been a beacon of hope and guidance for sailors and fishermen for generations. It was said that the light from the lighthouse could be seen even on the darkest of nights, leading ships safely to the harbor. However, as time passed, the once thriving town began to lose its charm. The sea breeze carried whispers of a lost magic that once enveloped Seaview Haven. Jamie, with his messy brown hair and wide eyes filled with curiosity, often found himself drawn to the lighthouse. He loved sitting by the cliffs, listening to the rhythmic sounds of the crashing waves and watching the distant ships pass by. There was a certain allure to the lighthouse that ignited his imagination, and he often wondered about the tales it held within its walls. One day, as Jamie explored the shore, he noticed a weathered map tucked between the pages of an old book in the town's dusty library. The map depicted a hidden island not far from Seaview Haven, marked with a symbol that resembled the lighthouse. Intrigued by the discovery, Jamie decided to embark on a journey to uncover the mystery behind the lost magic of the lighthouse. Equipped with the map, a small boat, and a sense of adventure, Jamie set sail towards the hidden island. The sea breeze played with his hair, and the salty air filled his lungs as the boat glided over the gentle waves. In the distance, the lighthouse stood tall, its light flickering faintly in the daylight. As Jamie approached the the island, he noticed a secluded cove with a narrow path leading to the heart of the land. The island was covered in lush vegetation, and the air was thick with the scent of blooming flowers. Following the path, Jamie stumbled upon a hidden clearing where an ancient stone pedestal stood. Upon the pedestal rested a crystal that radiated a soft, ethereal glow. Guided by an instinct he couldn't explain, Jamie reached out and touched the crystal. In an instant, he felt a surge of energy coursing through him, as if the island itself had recognized his presence. The crystal revealed memories of a time when the lighthouse held a magic that connected the town to the sea, fostering a sense of unity and prosperity. The magic, however, began to wane as the people of Seaview Haven forgot the importance of harmony with the sea. The crystal showed Jamie images of fishermen who no longer respected the sea, ships that disregarded the guidance of the lighthouse, and a town that slowly lost touch with the enchantment that had once defined it. Determined to restore the lost magic, Jamie returned to Seaview Haven with newfound purpose. He shared the tale of the hidden island and the crystal with the townspeople, urging them to rediscover their connection with the sea. The once thriving fishing community began to embrace old traditions, and the ships once again heeded the guidance of the lighthouse. As the town's bond with the sea strengthened, the lighthouse's light regained its brilliance. The red and white stripes glowed vibrantly, casting a warm and inviting glow that reached far across the waves. Seaview Haven, once shrouded in a sense of loss, began to bloom with renewed vitality. Jamie, now hailed as the town's young hero, continued his explorations around the lighthouse. One day, while examining the cliffs beneath the beacon, he discovered a hidden cavern filled with sparkling crystals. Each crystal, he realized, held a fragment of the island's magic. With the crystal, crystals, Jamie crafted a necklace, a symbol of the restored enchantment that now emanated from the lighthouse. The townspeople, inspired by his dedication and the newfound harmony with the sea, celebrated Jamie's discovery. The necklace became a cherished heirloom, passed down through generations as a reminder of the importance of respect and connection with nature.